It's a cool, sunny spring morning in downtown Kaiserslautern. Normally, the streets are bustling with people going about their business, but today they're pretty much empty. Everyone's week has been interrupted by a 250-pound piece of explosive history, a bomb from World War II. This one was found under a parking lot in downtown Kaiserslautern. Kaiserslautern was targeted by both the RAF and the U.S. Army Air Corps. My speculation at this point is this bomb uh, was, came out of the American arsenal and it was not uh, part of a planned campaign to uh, harass the population, but it was instead part of a campaign to hit the military targets. After the 569th U.S. Forces Police Squadron and Kaiserslautern Polizei evacuated the area around the site, a German EOD team came in to defuse the bomb. After over half an hour of working on the bomb with a saw and pliers, EOD Vorm's chief, Frank Bender, was able to defuse the bomb. When you're working, there is no fear. Afterwards, when you see the detonator, you may think, wow, that was a close call. But fear during diffusion? No. It's estimated that there are still over 50,000 dud bombs in Germany that were dropped by the Allies during World War II. Reporting from Kaiserslautern, Germany, I'm Airman First Class, Nate Gettleman.